How's it going guys? Welcome back to another video. Um, as requested, we are going to be doing a little walkthrough tour of um, kind of the setup that I have at the moment, as well as my collection. Um, so up here we've got all of our collectibles, our stuffed animals and toys and all that kind of stuff. Um, inside this Charizard box we have all of my extra uh, sleeves and all sorts of stuff like that. Uh, we have my graded card as well as cards that are looking to be graded. Um, we have down here all of our empty ETBs in the back, back here, and then um, these ETBs are all filled with bulk. We got some stickers. We've got my trick or trade booster packs that are going to be for Halloween. Um, over here is where we do all the recording, and right now we've got just a bunch of stuff that I've picked up either today or has come out of other videos that I've recorded recently. Um, all of these cards will be hitting the TCG Player Store. Um, Hopefully by the time you see this video, um, but if they're not there, then they're probably just sold already. Um, so all of these are going to be on the TCG Player Store pretty soon. Um, in this drawer, we've got all of our shipping stuff. We've got our stand. We've got some stuff that needs to be shipped out. Down here, we have our binder and our decks and our extra play mats, which we'll come back to those in just a second. Um, over here, we have some jumbo cards. Um, all of these are actually on the store right now as well. Um, in fact, at the time of recording this, all of these old school ones, we actually just picked these up today. Some really, really awesome old school Pokemon uh, jumbo cards right there. Um, we come back over here. We're going to go through the binder real quick, and then I want to show off um, some of the cards that I have in a few of my decks as well. So in the binder, um, open it up. We've got our McDonald's set for this year. Um, still missing just one card, but we're almost there. Um, then we've got our McDonald's cards that are listed for sales and trick or trade hollows. Um, our prize pack cards. Um, then we get into the main set of the collection. We've got our fire cards, our grass, and all, all of these cards in this binder, unless they're sold already, are listed on TCG Player at at this time. Um, we've got all of our water Pokemon, our electrics, this nice old school Jolteon right there. Uh, two of the more Peco V Union sets. Um, here's a free code card for you guys. Um, this code card is awesome in my opinion, just because it's so off centered and so off cut. Um, in fact, actually, looking on the back side, it's completely fine. Um, so I don't know how they cut the code cards. It's obviously got to be different than the regular Pokemon cards, because usually if a Pokemon card is off cut on one side, it's off on both. But anyways, I think that's awesome. Um, you guys can have that code that code for TCG Live, um, but I'm just going to keep hanging on to that card because that's awesome. Um, we've got all of our normal types, a nice E-Series, Meowth Promo, Mega Pidgeot, EX... Um, we've got all of our fighting type Pokemon. Moving on to Psychic. We have a lot of Psychic to get through. Sorry if the binder's not completely organized. I've been, like I said, we've been packing a lot of orders um, just this last weekend, or just since Sunday um, at the time of recording this. So in the course of about three or four days, um, I've packed over 40 orders. That's right, 40 orders. Um, so needless to say, the binder's kind of a mess right now. Um, just doing what I can to get the cards on their way to you guys who are purchasing from us. Um, some nice old school psychic right here. And we have our uh, steel type or metal type. Our dark type right here. Got a lot of great dark type Pokemon right now. That golden Moltres. Um, that alt art Hisuian Samurott is amazing. We have a Drapion Vista on that page by itself for some reason. Uh, we've got our Dragon types right there. Then we move into some of our trainers. Uh, we've got that Alt Art Grusha we just recently pulled, the Team Star Grunt, the Full Art Judge, some of the old school uh, reprints from the Celebrations collection. Uh, we've got an old Jesse and James. I think that actually just sold recently, so I've got to get that packed up and sent out. Archie's Ace in the Hole, great, great card. We have some of our more, like, uh, just fun, normal cards, some nice hollows, some nice reverse hollows. Some of these are listed, some of them aren't. Um, just kind of a hit or miss on if they're listed or not. Um, 
Silver Tempest Rapidash right there. We've got some Japanese from the Pokemon 151. Um, these two actually need to be over there with all of our graded stuff, or getting graded stuff, because those are going to be sent off pretty soon as well. We do have the full page of the Crown Zenith um, collection, uh, the full artwork there. A lot of the Lucario V Stars promos, um, some EV V Max promos, the Greninja uh, Gold Star promo, Mewtwo V, Pikachu, all that good stuff. Now we're getting into some of the energies. Now, I don't know about you guys, but as a collector, the energies are sometimes my favorite. Um, we do have the textured grass, the reverse water right here. Um, a lot of reverse grass, reverse metal, and reverse hollow fire energy. More water. Psychics. Fighting. All of these are reverse holographics. Uh, metal, psychic, fighting. A lot of electric. A lot of electric. More electric. Um, more electric. And now we get into the old school energies. Old school energies are awesome in my opinion. Um... We have Gym Challenge, Gym, uh, Gym Challenge, and Gym Leader Heroes. I'm not sure. I don't really remember which one's which. Um, just some old school 2005 uh, energy, 2007 base set two. Um, I don't remember what set that is. You guys can remind me in the comments. Um, we've got some base set right here. Base set two. A lot of really nice leaf energies grass energies um, then we get some some of the dark energies if i remember correctly these are actually the first printing of dark energy i could be wrong on that um, so correct me if i am we got all of our fire energies some base sets i think i have like three of these base sets back here um, base set two gym leaders gym challenge all that stuff um, some more metal energy psychics Psychics, again, we've got a lot of base, base set two, gym era, all of those things. Water is about the same. A lot of base set two, a lot of a little base set. Fighting as well. And electric, about the same. So a lot of old school energies. I, if you can't tell, I enjoy my old school energies. Um, do have some magic right here, if you guys are into that. Um, just opened up a few packs, not anything crazy, um, but I do have a little bit of it. Some of my, actually most of these magic cards are also listed on the website on TCG Player, so if you're interested in those, you can also grab them from my website. Um, we have some Marvel cards. These are actually not listed on TCG Player because TCG Player does not support this set, uh, but I think they're awesome. These two are actually stickers, which is insane to me. We got some Spider-Man, just some really cool cards. Now we get to just a bunch of extra trainers for when I'm, you know, looking at building decks or changing things out in decks. Just a bunch of trainers all throughout here. Kind of flip through a little bit faster. And each of these pockets have quite a, well, for the most part, most of these pockets have quite a few copies of each each one and then we get to some more deck building stuff we got that cleffa in case we want to use it in this palafin deck um we got some flaffies and mareep lines uh, archaeops in case we want to build that soul rock lunatone these are just some extra little staple things got the barrel lines um, an extra uh turbo lost kind of deck build there um, starting to build an extra of the United Wings deck. Um, some extra Fusion Strike. There's a Glamora. There's this Magnazone EX deck that I was looking at for a little bit. And there's some, some pieces for the Gardevoir deck. And that's actually the end of the binder. Um, so at this point, I want to push that aside. And we're actually going to go ahead and look at some of my decks that I have. So I'm going to set you guys up on the phone stand and since it's pointed that direction um, we're going to go ahead and look at this Mew deck first. This one is actually the only one of my fully built decks that is not or has not actually been played yet. Um, we actually just got the last few pieces of it this week. We have the Mew V of course, Mew V Max, uh, Genesect. They ha we do have this nice Oricorio to show off a little bit. 
bosses, Roxanne, nice old school judge, and then a few regular judges, Iono, Lost City, and Path to the Peak, Battle VIP Pass, Escape Rope, Switch Cart, Power Tablets, Ultra Balls, Feather Balls, Nest Balls, this old school Sun and Moon era, Nest Ball, uh, Pal Pad, and some Cramomatics, Echoing Horn, and a Reverse Lost Vacuum, as well as three regular ones, um, a Reverse Choice Belt, and then a, an, a just a plain Choice Belt, and then two Forest Seal Stones. These were the, actually the hardest pieces to find of this deck, but... Uh, and then uh, four double turbo energy. So that's the Mew deck. Pretty simple, pretty basic. Uh, now we get, we're going to get into this turbo loss deck. If you've seen me play this on TCG Live, I actually just played this um, this week at our local tournament. Um, I think I went two and one with it. Just lost to the mirror match running the Giratina variant. Does that play Pokemon Sableye as well as a regular one? Um, really, really fun deck to play, um, as long as you can wrap your head around it, it does get kind of complicated, and it's, you gotta do a lot of thinking and mapping of, like, what you're gonna do next, and all that kind of stuff, but if that's the kind of way that you like to play Pokemon, then I think this deck is right up your alley, it's really easy, really fun, uh, Poke Gear, we do have the Play Pokemon Lost Vacuum, some old, uh, I think that's Ancient Origins, actually, from the X and Y era of Energy Recyclers. Mirage Gates, Switch Carts, um, an old school, I think that's Primal Clash, that set. Uh, Escape Rope, Nest Balls, Heavy Ball, another Forest Seal Stone, as well as the Sky Seal Stone. And then what did I tell you? Energies are my favorite. We have... The Play Pokemon, Psychic Energy, Base Set Psychic, and Holographic XY Evolutions Psychic Energy. For Waters, we have Base Set 2, Base Set 1, <laughs> uh, 2007 era, and a Holographic. I think this is just coming from a theme deck. Um, for, psych or for Electric Energies, we have this awesome Sun and Moon Electric Reverse Hollow and this E-Series Electric Energy. So that's all there is to show off in the Turbo Loss deck. Uh, and then last but not least, we have our United Wings deck. Um, for United Wings, we're starting off with the Flamigos. Just one reverse right now, three regulars. Uh, we do have the four... Uh, <laughs> the Pumpkachu, P Pikachu Pumpkin, Jack-O-Lantern thing stamped Murkrows. Uh, we have two reverse watch rolls, two regular watch rolls, a reverse and a regular hollow ditto, two squawkabilly EX, um, three routes, doesn't really matter which routes you run, just as long as it only has the one, one retreat cost is the big thing here, uh, three refinement curlias, one regular, one reverse, and one that is the Silver Tempest pre-release promo, uh, a Gallade with Buddy Catch, a Gallade with Dynablade. You can see that. Uh, we have our Alt Art Mana Fee to kind of show off a little bit. A Full Art Professor's Research, as well as three of the Cosmo Hollow Professor's Research. Full Art Zinnia's Resolve. Two different Full Art Bosses Orders. A Hollow or Cosmo Hollow Clara. Reverse Serena. Two regular Collapse Stadiums. Two different reverse switches, a reverse hollow echoing horn, pal pad, level ball, nest ball, reverse research carry or rescue carrier, uh, four ultra balls, uh, heavy ball, four double turbo energies, and we're back to some more energies. So here's some show off time. We have this reverse dark energy. We have this reverse dark energy, we have this old school dark energy, and then we have this one. This one might actually be my favorite dark energy. I'm trying to keep my hand out of this from making a shadow for you guys. Um, but this dark energy, if you can't tell, is a little miscut. On this side, it is rounded like normal, but on this side, it's actually sharp. 
uh, not cut on the side. Um, and it actually has um, one of the alignment dots, if you guys can see it right up there in that corner. Um, so one of my favorite energy cards that I have actually. Um, but yeah, so that's the setup. That's the collection. Those are the decks that I have. Um, I hope you guys have enjoyed this little tour, checking out the setup and the collection. Um, so if you guys enjoyed the video, go ahead and leave a like. Uh, comment what your favorite card that you saw in my collection is. And leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Have a good one.